Driving till I see the dawn Hanging on my harvest drum Taxi take me to my slot Look at me, but here I come Queen bee, buzzing proud Buzzing me through the crowd Burned out in a broken plow Working hard and playing loud I don't have a bugger down Right now, the man himself, Lee Harvey Osmond, a quiet evil, is with us and will be on the show today. So, Lee Harvey Osmond was born and raised where? He was born and raised in a uh, garage uh, off Clinton Avenue in Toronto, Canada. Uh, it was put together with uh, Mike Timmons and uh, Margot Timmons from the Cowboy Junkies, my friends uh, Andy and Josh from the Sky Diggers, uh, bass player from the Sadies, uh, a drummer from an old band I was in in the 90s called Junk House that had hits everywhere in the world except for the United States. Can you imagine that? And um, also uh, a legendary folk uh, singer named Brent Titko. You have had a kind of career, a single career that was in between bands. I mean, you had Junk House, as you say, yeah. and then you had, now you have, uh, from time to time at least, Blackie and the Rodeo Kings, which is a great band, but you're not always together. No, I think it's how we managed to stay together for 13 years so far, is by, uh, by having solo careers and having interests outside of Blackie and the Rodeo Kings. I mean, you can, uh, you can see bands uh, fall apart in front of your eyes, you know. They can basically chew their arm off to get the, themselves out of bands sometimes. And uh, we never wanted to become a band. We never recorded that first record intending to be a band. And so we still stand as three individual artists who uh, luckily get to play together. Well, the moral of this story is easy for you to see. John Henry's laying six feet down in the cold, cold, cold ground. He ended up the same as you and me, boys. Well, he ended up the same as you and me. When John Henry was... Well, for those Americans who aren't totally familiar with Tom Wilson, as they should be, uh, tell us uh, your, your musical history. Did you start as a kid playing music? I started, uh, I started off uh, doing, as a folk singer in coffee houses. And um, uh, along with another guy named Fred Eaglesmith, oh, yeah. uh, we started off out of the same coffee house in Hamilton, Ontario. And um, we were young, and we were, uh, you know, probably a little rambunctious. But we found uh, we didn't find an audience for ourselves back then. But we did find fellow artists that uh, liked uh, that liked us and took us under their wing. People like Willie P. Bennett and the late Stan, hey. late Willie P. Bennett. I'm sorry to say, Stan Rogers, yeah. uh, Canadian folk singers like uh, David Whiffen, Brent Titcombe. Uh, Doug MacArthur, Murray McLaughlin, were all people that uh, kind of were interested or, or recognized our youth and recognized that our desire to perform. Does your humor, has it always been manifested in your songs? Not that you're, you're a comedian. But... I think that uh, to be a musician where I'm from, Canada, you better have a good sense of humor. Yeah. It's kind of a joke in Canada that uh, what, would you, what would a Canadian musician do if he won a million dollars in the lottery? He'd keep playing till he ran out of money. Yeah. You know, so that's, it's kind of, uh, you better be funny. Yeah. Well, we're, we're happy to have you on the show today. And uh, Lee Harvey Osmond, today, there he is. Look at that. Nice. Isn't that, in case, for those of you who can't see that well. It's, it's amazing these cameras can do that. It's, he, uh, it's going to, our band will join you, right? Yeah. But oh, who, man. the one of the what junkies played on your record? Uh, well, Michael produced it. He produced and, it. And uh, Michael right. played on it. And Margot and I do two duets on this, a song called You're Gonna, I'm Gonna Stay That Way. Is she going to sing with you today? I don't think today. Today okay. is uh, my first day on the Cowboy Junkie Tour, and okay. this is the first show I'm doing. So you haven't gone over any of that stuff? No. Since you know, the record? No. In well, fact, you can give it a fly. We don't care. You can do it on the fly if you want. You know Margo, what? Margo's think, game. I feel like I'm ruining my career. I might as well ruin someone else's. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. Well, thanks a lot for being with Thank us. you for having me. It's yeah. a pleasure to be on Mountain Stage.
the cuckoo's nest. I